Hi, my name is Kate. The reason that I think I would be a good candidate for this role is that I was born to be in customer service and I thrive on connecting with people and making their day. Um, as you can see from my resume, I've had a couple of roles in different industries, um, mostly pharmacy. Um, and the reason that I got into those roles was because at the core of it was helping other people, which is what I love to do. So initially I started my career in pharmacy when I relocated from Tassie to here, which is the Gold Coast for me. Um, I moved to a, an admin role, but that was still customer service based. Um, and yeah, so I just really like that connecting with people and being able to have as many opportunities as you can to help them and to brighten their day. Um, I'd like to explain a little bit about my roles because one of my qualities that I think I also bring to this is that I am a very loyal person, as you can see from me working in my hospital pharmacy job for 17 years, because if I click and I really like something and I feel like I can be my most genuine at it, then I'll completely 100% dedicate myself to it and stick, stick to it as much as I can. When I moved to the Gold Coast, the admin role that I got, I really enjoyed it because it was customer service, but that business was moving in a different direction and they were going to head down doing online um, ordering and things which would actually take away my role. So um, that's why I moved to the current position I'm in now, which is in a vet clinic. Um, and you might see that I've only been there for six months and I don't want that to be a concern to you if you think that um, I leave things quickly. The reason that I am not feeling 100% satisfied with the vet clinic work is that I don't feel it enables me to connect with people and help people very much. It's a very, very busy clinic and I'm not afraid of hard work. I actually like hard work, um, but it just doesn't allow us any time to engage with clients really. Like I still try as best as I, as I can, um, but when you're talking to somebody and you've got five people lined up behind them, it's really hard to be able to have those more deeper, meaningful conversations with people and run around the counter and meet their dog and connect with them and things, and I just really miss that, and I just feel like it's a bit of an impersonal um, clinic that I'm working in. It's just too fast-paced to be able to make those beautiful, meaningful connections, and I just really miss that. So when I saw this role, it encompasses everything that I love, uh, which is being able to encourage people, support people, um, make their day and be that positive light that they might need, the encouragement that they might need and just to be able to help and support people as best I can because that's what I really love. Um, the qualities that I would be able to bring to this role is that I'm very, very positive. I'm actually known in my current workplace as Mary Poppins because no matter how yucky it gets I am the one who's lifting up the team and trying to keep things as positive and um, uplifting as we can. Um, I'm very organised and, um, and a full inbox or a full in tray is just merely a challenge to me and I'm very good at looking at what needs to be done first, prioritising my work so that I can get through it as quickly and efficiently as possible and having that pharmacy background um, I'm quite obsessed with accuracy and everything being neat and in order. Um, I'm very kind and compassionate. I wear my heart on my sleeve um, and I'm not afraid to be vulnerable. So I'm happy to do whatever it takes to help somebody feel heard and taken care of and looked after and to have those tricky conversations to get into the nitty gritty and, and just do whatever it takes to make them feel better. Um, and yeah, at the crux of it all, I just like to be able to take care of people and um, yeah, and make sure that I'm doing all I can to make them have a positive experience and walk away feeling like they've been heard and they've been supported. So those are the main reasons why I feel like I would be a good candidate for this job, um, because it would be my passion is the taking care of people and supporting them. And I think while you're doing something that you're passionate about, then it actually uplifts you and energises you rather than draining you and it's something that you can stick at forever and really dedicate yourself to. So I'm hoping that I might have a chance to chat to you more about that um, and yeah, and prove to be a great fit for your team. It would be an honour. Thanks very much.